What is going on all of you gaming legends out there? My name is Tyler Death the Iam and this is an ace breakdown on the map of cargo using the M8A1. Thank you Spartan for initially giving us this idea. Now what I'm going to do is show you guys the raw ace and then from there I'm going to move into my class setup and then do a step by step breakdown of the ace to show you guys my thoughts and actions which influence the round for me. Hopefully by seeing something like this you guys can become more effective and more objective search and destroy players and better your search and destroy gameplay. So without further ado let's go ahead and watch the ace. Eliminate the objective. Bomb acquired. Concussion out! Threat neutralized. Care package on standby. Hunter killer drone on standby. Hunter killer drone deployed. The bomb has been planted. Attack reload. I know, I know, I'm a beast, what a sick ace. Now what I've got here for you guys is my M8A1 class. I've been mixing things up a ton, because I'm working on a new series for you guys. So, that's why you guys see the fucked up score streaks in the bottom. Uh, the M8A1 has a FMJ and a reflex sight on it, and I'm running the TAC-45 because the M8 is a monster at medium to long range, but close encounters with the reflex can be kind of chancy, especially when you risk hip firing it. So that's why I have a TAC-45 as a secondary, and so so that's why I have that. Uh, two times concussion grenades to nail guys at long range. Uh, the C4, obviously I'm a C4 horde. Tack mass, toughness, and hard line to get my streaks faster. So that's what I've got on this class here. And what we're going to move into next is breaking down the ace step by step. Now when you initially start the round on cargo as you're about to see, there are four different routes you can take. And here we go. So, start off the match. And this guy's going to make a dolphin dive for the bomb, but we're going to hold him up for a second here. You can run to the left, you can run straight, you can run up into the cargo containers, or you can push to the far right. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to run cargo containers, and when I always run cargo containers, I tend to throw a concussion grenade across the map to try and stun that platform on the other side where all the whores with their LMGs and snipers tend to sit. Luckily, there's nobody over there, so I'm able to push straight up to the bomb, which is usually what I like to do for my initial rush. I'm going to find a guy here, jump out, and I see two... But luckily for me, there's a third by the barrels in the back. So I'm going to patiently pick these guys off as they stick their fucking heads up. And boom, there's the triple. And this dumbass is going to run right in front of me, giving me my quad. Now here, there's four guys down already in the first 15, 20 seconds of the match. So I'm going to whip my hunter killer up in the air, hopefully pick up another guy there. Now I'm going to move up here to give me a better overall view of the map. Because for right now, as you can tell, my team has moved forward and pushed them to the back of their spawn. Somehow one got out, which I'm guessing initially through office buildings. So when my hunter killer blows up in the back, I know there's a kid behind us. And that's why I turned around to kill this guy. That's five down. Waiting for the last. I'm going to reload, get ready for the next battle in case one happens I see shots fired on radar that radar is so key in certain destroy it is your everything so I push to the back of the map pick off the sixth guy there's the ace if you guys enjoyed something like this please let me know in the comment section below and as always have a gorgeous day you beautiful motherfuckers